Hi, my name is Pat, and this is my channel, Book Chat with Pat, and I'm glad that you're here. Today I'm going to be doing the library tag. This is an original tag created by Joe and Mary at BookBuds, and I was tagged by Joe and Mary at BookBuds. So I'm going to read first a little statement from BookBuds about the tag. It says, a new original tag from BookBuds, the library tag. Did you know BookBuds films right next to a library? We had to make this tag. Let's talk about your library habits. We have, we have questions for both those of you that go to the library and those of you that don't. Answer the questions that apply to you. If you do go to the library, answer these. Number one, how often do you go to the library? I should go more than I do because I have a problem of compulsively buying books. I would do well to borrow more from the library. Lately, I've been going to the library about once a week, but what I'm doing is basically dropping off bags of books that I'm donating to the library. I'm in the process of clearing out a good part of my library upstairs and donating to the public library so they can use those books at their sale. Uh, and then after I donate, I make a little circle around the library and, and see if there's anything that I want to take home with me. Um, number two, do you belong to more than one library system? I belong to one library system, but it connects me to the libraries in towns all around, you know, several counties actually. Um, so I, ha I have access to a lot of, of libraries, but it's one, it's one system. Um, what percent of books you read come from the library? I would say 20%. Uh, I, m most of my books are books that I, and most of the books that I read are books that I have um, purchased. Number four, do you listen to audiobooks or get ebooks from the library or are you hooked on Audible or Amazon or something else? Um, all of the above, I would say. Um, I, I do have Audible. Um, I use Amazon. I buy a lot of books from thrift books. Uh, but I also get ebooks and audiobooks from the library. And my library is hooked up to uh, Libby and Hoopla, and I borrow both ebooks and audiobooks through that system as, as well. So I, I do all of, all of the above. Number five Did you go to story time at the library as a kid? I don't remember my library having a story time when I was a kid, but I went to the library every Saturday when I was a little kid. I, I have vivid memories of my mother taking me to the library um, on Saturday, and I loved the children's room in the library. I loved the furniture. I loved the little chairs and the little tables. And, and I would go home every Saturday with as many books as I was allowed to take out. Um, I don't ever remember a librarian doing story time in my public library back in the dark ages when I was a child. They certainly do it now. Uh, and I remember story time from the school librarians, uh, but I don't remember the public library doing that unless I, I mean, I would imagine it would have been on a Saturday and I have no memory of, of that at, at all. Um, okay. Number six, have you ever borrowed a movie or video game from your library? Yes, I have borrowed movies from the library. I have never borrowed a video game from the library. 
Number seven, have you ever gotten fined for returning books late? And if so, how do you feel about that? I have never gotten fined in my adulthood. I definitely got fined as a kid going to the library and returning books late. And I don't really have any feelings about it one way or another. We should return our books when they're due. Uh, and, and I don't think they're making a fortune on, on, uh, on, on fines. Um, number eight, do you attend special events, groups, or book sales at your library? Yes, but not enough. My library does a lot of really good stuff, and, and I, don't, um, I don't think I take advantage of all the things that, that, they, that they offer. They, um, they have a lot of speakers there. They have, um, they have guest speakers. They have, uh, they have reading groups. Uh, they have a lot of stuff also for, um, for teens. They do really good stuff, and, and I don't take advantage of that. I do support their book sales. Um, right now, I'm, I'm providing them with a lot of books for their next book sale, but I always love to go to their book sales too. Number nine, have you ever given or taken a book from a little free library, a book box, or a book swap? I donate books to little free libraries all the time. I've never actually taken a book out of a little free library. I have one here in my development where I live, and I am keeping it very well stocked. I've never taken anything back out of, the, of that little library, and we have them all over town. Uh, there, there are many, many of these little free libraries, and, and I think they're adorable and wonderful, and I put books in them, but I've never taken, uh, I've never taken one out. Um, number 10, bonus. Does your librarian know you by name? No. We have a bunch of librarians. Uh, there are a lot of librarians in my library, but I don't think anybody knows me by, by name. No. And then last, last one is number 11, tag some friends. So the first person I'm going to tag is Angelia at Read and Reread. She is a retired librarian, and this, this tag was made for her. So Angelia at Read and Reread, Gavin at Genre Books, James at Quaint and Curious Volumes, Ellen at Ellen Made Book Club, Renee at Beyond Books, Nikki at My Messy Bookshelf, Debs at Rainer Reads Stuff, uh, Mild Rumpus, um, Aaron at Aaron Read a Book, and Aaron at Aaron Facer. Okay, and anybody else who's watching this, um, uh, if, if you go to the library or if you don't go to the library, there are, there are also seven questions for those who don't use their library, and I'll put those in, in the notes. So if you're watching this and you'd like to do this tag, please consider yourself tagged. As always, thank you for watching. I hope that you're doing well. I'll speak with you again soon. Take care.